So what are Boolean operators? You actually use Boolean operators every day and don't even realize it. They are common words used in everyday conversations to connect parts of your speech. These words are AND, OR, NOT. Using these three words, you will be able to control what you search for with much more accuracy by narrowing your results, expanding your results, and excluding certain results. To start understanding Boolean operators, let's begin with AND. AND is used to connect two ideas or phrases together as a means to narrow down what you're looking for. For example, you want information on foods that include peanut butter and jelly. Without the AND operator, our search would turn up results for peanut butter cookies or jelly donuts. We don't want this information, but once we stick AND between these two phrases, our search will include only resources that mention both combined phrases, like peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. So how does the Boolean operator OR differ? While well, AND was for narrowing down your search results, OR is used to expand results. Turning back to our peanut butter and jelly example, by typing OR between these two phrases, we will find all resources that use the phrase peanut butter OR the phrase jelly. The results will include not only resources on peanut butter and jelly sandwiches, but also resources on peanut butter cookies OR jelly donuts. Finally, we come to the NOT Boolean operator. NOT is used when you want to exclude certain words or phrases from your search. Let's visit our peanut butter and jelly example one last time. For this last search, we want to look for everything that mentions peanut butter, but leave out anything that might mention jelly. By typing NOT between these two phrases, our search will turn up resources for peanut butter cookies, but not anything on jelly donuts or peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. Now that we have an understanding of what Boolean operators are, where can we use them? Boolean operators can be used in any situation where you are performing a search. They can be used on online search engines like Google, Yahoo, or Bing. They can be used when searching through the library catalog. They can be used when searching for articles through our library databases. In fact, some databases have Boolean operators built right in for you to use. By using Boolean operators, you can take more control over what you're searching for and what is retrieved by your search no matter what platform you are using.